So let's give you the latest from Jakarta and Palembang, the host cities for the 2018 Asian Games. And history was made on Sunday as a unified Korean team, athletes from the North and South working together, grabbed a gold in their event. As for South Korea, the country remains in third in the medal standings, quite a way behind China and Japan. Now, Won Jung Hwan with the details. The unified Korean canoeing team continued its historic run at the Asian Games on Sunday, winning gold in the women's 500-meter dragon boat racing event. The 16-member team clocked a time of 2 minutes 24 seconds, beating China by a third of a second. It was the second medal won by a joint Korean team at an international multi-sport competition, following the bronze medal the women's team won in the 200-meter dragon boat event the day before. Arirang, Korea's most popular folk song, played as the unification flag was raised high during the medal ceremony. The medal won't count to either South or North Korea in the Asian Games medal standings. Instead, it was awarded to Korea. Previously, unified Korean teams won gold medals in the women's team event at the 1991 World Table Tennis Championships and in mixed doubles at the 2018 International Table Tennis Korea Open. But Sunday's victory marks the first time the joint forces to win gold at a multi-sport competition. Another gold medal for South Korea came from the track on Sunday, as Chung Erim won the women's 100-meter hurdles. Chung finished first in the time of 13.2 seconds, 0.13 seconds ahead of the runner-up. While Chung's medal is the country's first athlete's gold in Jakarta, it holds extra meaning as Team Korea failed to win any gold medals in track and field events at the 2014 Asian Games at Incheon. South Korea's other gold of the day came in sports climbing. Chun jong won gold in the men's combined sport climbing event. However, a disappointing loss for South Korea in baseball. The two-time defending champions started their campaign with a 2-1 loss to Chinese Taipei on Sunday. The national baseball team had only six hits against three amateur pitchers from the Taiwanese Industrial League. South Korea's next game is against the host nation Indonesia. The action gets underway on Monday evening at 8.30 p.m. Korea time. Won Jong-hwan, Arirang News.